Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video is gonna be a grocery haul. I go grocery shopping every two weeks for my family and try to get everything we need for the two weeks that we'll need it. And I'm gonna go ahead and just jump into it so I can get this all into my fridge and freezer. Okay, so starting over here with the frozen stuff, I have two packs of the Ezekiel flax bread. I love all the seeds it has on it, and I really like this with the chickpea salad I make. Right here is Uncrustables. JR takes these to school. And then this is what I have instead of ice cream at night, and they are seriously so good. Mango is my favorite. Grape is good, and strawberry is another really good flavor too. We don't always get this big 12 sized value pack of Danimal, so whenever I see it, I grab it up. For JR, he likes to have these. And then this is just chocolate chip waffles. I put peanut butter on these in the morning, and they're just like a super quick, easy, yummy breakfast for myself. I got two bags of the strawberries that are frozen. I'm gonna go ahead and dethaw these and make homemade fruit roll up with it. This is just a pack of turkey bacon. I don't really like regular bacon unless I'm doing a recipe with it, so turkey bacon for breakfast for dinner night. Two packs of ground beef. I got this for Nolan. He really likes these, so strawberry shortcake popsicles. And then I also got him two of these Jimmy Dean's breakfast bowls, the bacon flavor. He is gonna be off this weekend for 4th of July, so this just cuts down on grabbing breakfast out. Two bags of the frozen broccoli. I've been buying fresh broccoli, but these were more expensive than I'd like to admit. And if I have something I can just throw into the microwave, I find that there's usually a vegetable on our plates for dinner if it's easy like that. And then I got a pack of the crescent rolls. You can make a delicious, really yummy, dairy-free like garlic bread with this since we're avoiding all dairy for Grayson. That's for one of the meals. And then I got three packs of chicken. They only carry the Tyson. It's not what I would choose, but this is the one I get, the premium boneless skinless chicken breasts. Right here I have orange juice. I've really been liking orange juice in the morning, so no pulp for sure. And my home state, Florida. This is the creamer I'm addicted to. I put it way too much of it in my coffee every morning. The Carmel Macchiato International Delight's my favorite. They only had one coconut milk, raspberry. Um, this stuff's delicious. Like I said, we're avoiding dairy. I don't eat normal yogurt, but this is like, tastes whipped. It's delicious, and they only had the one, so I only got the one. This was an impulse buy, but this will be a tons of meals for us, and it just looks delicious. So we'll have that one night, just some fish burgers. I got two bags of leafy green romaine. Uh, this is for taco salad. I prefer shredded iceberg, but the shredded iceberg was $6.98 a bag. So we passed on that. This is just a head of green lettuce. This is gonna be cups for burgers instead of buns. This is green beans. This is gonna go in a few stir fry recipes. And then just three heads of broccoli. This, I try to put broccoli in everything. I like broccoli a lot. This is bok choy. This is also for a stir fry recipe. Oh, hello, bu Bubba. This is a big thing of baby spinach. I'm gonna try and put this in whatever I can. This is rice noodles. We've never had these before, but this is for a meal I'm doing this month too, a new meal. These are also for Nolan, a little snack. He likes Pop-Tarts, he wanted the s'mores. These are my favorite um, tortillas that we have here. I wish they had like spinach tortilla wraps. They have so many cool ones in the States of grocery hauls I watch of other people. Flour, this is the best I can get here. So until we get to the States, that's what we're having. Spicy sweet chili Doritos, the best flavor, and that's just for 4th of July weekend, along with these, the Fritos Flavor Twists Honey Barbecue. I like to make my own taco seasoning, but um, I decided to just get a packet this time. This is the Golden Raisins, the sour strawberry. They just taste like normal like golden raisins, but these are for JR's lunch. I got four oranges because they were like 50 cents a piece and they're normally like $2 a piece. So that was a really good deal. I grabbed two red onions, a ginger paste since I could not find any minced ginger. So I don't know where they keep that in the store, but I just got that instead. A pack of bananas. Yeah, apple. You can have an apple later. Hold on. I got three sweet potatoes. They don't carry American sweet potatoes here in Japan. There's an embargo on it, so we get this kind. These are Japanese plums. Another thing that they have an embargo on is plums, nectarines, green apples, um, along with the sweet potatoes, which are what I crave the most during summer. So this will do. Two packs of the fat, short Japanese carrots. Five apples, I believe this was John Gold. It was the cheapest one per pound, so that's what I ended up getting today. Salsa Verde for a crock pot chicken taco recipe. Crunchy peanut butter for satay chicken. 
two jars of roasted garlic. They did not have zucchini, but I'm having zucchini noodles with vegan meat um, pasta one night, and this is for that. Beets for the burgers to top it, and the whole peeled tomatoes for a shepherd's pie. I got a bag of the whole pitted dates. I wanna go ahead and try and make a dessert with these. And then I got two bags of the 50% less sugar craisins. They're tart, and I love to snack on these, especially when I'm cooking. This is also for JR's school lunches, Scooby Snacks. These are also for Fourth of July weekend since I think we're going over to a neighbor's house. Um, we don't drink at all, so I got Virgil's root beer, Virgil's cream soda. They're in bottles. It'll be fun to have that little treat. Root beer, just because impulse buy. This is also an impulse buy. I wanted orange soda, but I knew I wouldn't drink a eight pack, so I just got a bottle. We got a little six pack of the fruit punch, a six pack of the orange, and a six pack of the berry Gatorades. And these are for Nolan. They're really, really cheap at the grocery store this size, so went ahead and got him that. And then I just got one juice, peach mango. It's delicious. And then these are also for JR's lunch. They're fruit and vegetable apple juices, and he doesn't know the difference. And then we are big soda drinkers. We drink water and stuff too, but soda is what we live on with three kids. Dr. Pepper Cherry, Vanilla Coke. I wish we had the not zero version, but that's all we have. And then regular Dr. Pepper. I spent $213 on all of this, and this should feed us for two weeks. I will probably go out to the farmer's market out in town since the produce is so expensive on base. I spent over $50 on this produce right here, so if I get a chance this weekend to go off base and pick out some apples and some more fruit, if I can find it, like pineapple and stuff, um, I'll definitely go ahead and buy that, uh, go up to the 250 budget I have. But that's everything I got for our family for this two week periods of dinners, lunches, and breakfasts. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave in the comments down below or in the description bar down below what I'm making for the two weeks, what my meals are gonna be. I only plan 10 or 11 meals per paycheck because you know you always order a pizza or you get food out or there's leftovers or something comes up. So I don't wanna waste food. So this is everything we're gonna be having. I'm gonna go ahead and put in the description bar down below. Make sure you check it out. And thanks for watching. If you guys wanna see more grocery hauls, go ahead and let me know. I've gotta go put this all in my freezer with this handsome fella before it all melts. All right guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you click like and subscribe and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.